You're watching KRQE News 13 at 530 with Jessica Gattaday, Dean Staley, and weather with Chief Meteorologist Mark Ronchetti. Local reporting you can trust. Every year, people come to Albuquerque to marvel at the site that is the International Balloon Fiesta. Now, filmmakers from New York have put together a film showcasing the beauty of ballooning here. They also feature a few notable pilots. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen gives you a look at the film. Wind Riders is the brainchild of director Emi Katayama. It's a documentary that follows the stories of three hot air balloon pilots. Two of them have strong roots here in Albuquerque. And that's often how these Gordon Bennett races end. To win these races, you have to push the balloon to its absolute limits. You have to push yourself to the absolute limit. Richard Abruzzo and Carol Reimer Davis have flown at Albuquerque's International Balloon Fiesta many times. But in 2010, the duo crashed their balloon off the coast of Italy in a thunderstorm during the Gordon Bennett gas balloon race. 68 days later, a a small fishing boat found their gondola with their bodies inside. I think it's miraculous that this was found after all this time. While Katayama's film shows the beauty and awe in ballooning, she also makes a mention of the tragedy that can come from it. There was rough weather at the balloon's last known location. Wind Riders also features pilot Bill Hughes. What is going to allow you to come to grips with what the real risk in balloon flying is? Hughes is no stranger to Albuquerque either. He's flown at Balloon Fiesta a few times in the 1970s and has has trained more than 2,700 pilots in 34 states. Wind Riders is set to debut at the Manhattan Film Festival May 3rd. Seems to defy science almost. It does seem magical. Jeannie Nguyen, KRQE News 13. And our very own former Sky News 13 helicopter pilot Bob Martin also had a hand in making this film. The director says Bob helped provide some of the aerial footage of Balloon Fiesta in the documentary. 